Good morning everybody and welcome to Vlogmas Day 22. Honestly can't believe where the time's gone. Can you? Mum's like, it's too early in the morning. I'm not talking. <laughs> Guess what Mum, I've got something to tell you. He's trying to get me to speak. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I have actually got something to tell you. Someone commented on my vlog, like either it was the last vlog I uploaded or the one before, and guess what? They put, I love seeing your nan and your mum in your in your vlogmases. And I went, don't worry, there'll be in plenty more to come. Oh, I can't wait. Now I've finished work, it's really hit me that it's the Christmas holidays, and I am so happy about it. Get to chill, get to have time with the family, great food, great laughs, and I'm just so excited. So. Yeah, but today is going to be a really busy day. I've got my nails booked for 12, which I've just confirmed with the nail shop because I had it down as 11.30 and my boss had it down as 12. Of course, my boss had it down, right? But, you know, never mind. Um, so I'm getting my nails done at 12, thank goodness. I'm thinking about going for all gold. What do you think? But, but I'm getting a different shape. I'm not getting this shape this time and I'm getting all tips. So... Yeah, but I need to buy some new earphones. This is the third pair of earphones I've had to buy myself. So I lost my pair on my Christmas night out, my second pair. Then mum gave me her spare pair that are like really the old fashioned ones. And I was working yesterday, clocked off, so I was listening to music. And um, somehow I completely wrecked them. So I need to buy a new pair of earphones. And they cost me £20. So this would have been £60 of my money I would have spent on earphones. Mum? Mm. Fun! But yeah, so need to do that I need to buy some jeans need to buy some converse style shoes from Primark I also need to film my makeup look which I'm now going to do because I've got more time than I thought I did so that's always great and then when I come home from getting my nails done I'm going to finish off packing and then like my toiletries my makeup and all that sort of thing then I'm going to wheel my suitcase and my laptop around to my grandma's because there won't be enough room in the uber for everything so yeah that is the plan. So I am back home now. Literally, it's been such a stress. I've got my nails done. I absolutely bloody love them. I am so obsessed. I thought either gold or silver in the end, and I went with silver. I went with my gut, and for once, my gut was right. But I managed to get the shoes. I actually really like them, the shoes I wanted to get. I can't remember how much I've said in this vlog because so much has happened. And then after I got my nails done, I went back into town. I went to Primark. I don't actually. Um, I went to get my jeans, which I've got. I've also got my deodorant, my eyebrow pencil. I got some extra nail files just that I've got because they were really cute and a pound. I've got some of the bits and pieces which I'm gonna show you in just a minute and I also did a quick food stop at a little Tesco's because they're just little snacks I wanna to take to my grandma's over Christmas really. There's gonna be plenty of food, but you know, like the nibbly bits that also I can share with people that want them. But these are my nails. They will have a post very soon on my beauty Instagram account because, oh, I love them. I love this shape. I need to go for this shape every single time. It's so more me. And they're all tips. I got my nails chopped because they were so weak. So yeah. So these are the nail files I got. They're just from Flutter. They were down to a pound and they're really cute. So I thought I'd have those. Got my eyebrow pencil. This is just the Rimmel brow pencil in hazel. This is a present from an extra present from my boss. I've got to put that in like the section of little presents to take around to grandma's. Got two deodorant sprays because I needed them, quite frankly. I also got myself a fuel. I've not had one of these in ages, but I love it. Got Mango Tango. Got the meal deal. So I've got Pepsi Max. Hula hoop and BLT. That is not for now because obviously I've just had a fuel. I'm so full. But I'm going to the Panto with my grandma, my boss, and some other very lovely people. So I thought just for a light tea beforehand. I also got some Maltesers to take with me because I bloody love these and they were on offer. Got some chunky chocolate cookies because I know my grandma and my mum would love sharing these. I will give them to Lynn, but she can't have wheat or gluten, so she won't be able to have those. And I also got some kettle mature cheddar and red onion because these are my favourite kettle crisps and also my mum likes them. And my grandma, so I shared them with them as well. My Reebok trainers are currently in there because I went to the toilets in my local shopping centre and switched out the shoes. So these are my jeans. I got a size 16 because size 14 was way too tight. I'm not ashamed to say I have a size 16 jeans because they're comfortable and I love them. They're the super high waist skinny, so that's what I like. I find super high waist is so much better.
much more flattering. So, yeah. And they were £9 each, which I thought was really reasonable. I won't go anywhere else but Primark for my jeans. So now I'm going to put stuff away. I look so sweaty and disgusting. I was going to change up my makeup for the panto tonight. But I won't have time because it is 10 to 3. I need to finish packing all my toiletry, skincare bits, makeup, which I'm going to show you what I'm including in that. Um, bung that in my suitcase, get my laptop, my laptop charger, my notebook, my pens. Um, because I'm wheeling all that around to my grandma's. And then when my mum gets back, we're sorting out all her stuff. And then we're getting an Uber with the rest of the things. So, yeah, my stress levels are like so high right now. My panic levels are really high because I know I've got so much to do in such little time. So... I'm just gonna get on but I actually am starting to love this eye makeup look so thank you glitzy I love this glitter like my overflow makeup bag i know i pack way way too much i get so many comments on it especially when i took my makeup to cornwall there were so many comments going you pack way too much makeup you're never going to use all that i know but i'm one of those people that would rather overpack than underpack so yeah i just got my contour palette some glitters some lip products in here my mist sponge contour palette and bits and pieces this is literally just like overflow and my mini makeup bag that came in this set which is from primark by the way definitely recommend them i have my chargers and things like that in there and then this is my main makeup bag nothing else could fit in this it's just got all sorts my highlighter from libby which by the way i've tested and i love it it's so beautiful my little eyeshadow from the christmas fringe from primark brow stuff new things that i might want to try luxurious things that i've treated myself to just everything that i could possibly want to go to to be honest so i'm back home and i'm now about to eat my dinner because it is 10 to 5 and we are literally just hurrying up um now and just doing the final touches really grandma's we've got everything in one piece the uber driver was so Actually lovely splendid. he was wasn't he oh, he was so nice. nice he was really and it only cost us a five and normally if they have to wait for you it they charge you more but obviously he clearly didn't which is really lovely of him so it only cost us a fiver bargain absolute bargain so yeah but we've got everything here he helped us get the luggage out he was just generally <laughs> mum reckons it's more than we took to cornwall don't you yes i do indeed Hi. Hi. See you later. Me and Grandma are on our. What time? What time when does it start? Seven, which is why we've got uh, quarter past pretty much. Oh, which is right. which is why we need to get there for half past six. Um, but yeah, me and Grandma are on our jolly well way, aren't we, Grandma? Mm -hmm. We're going to go to the pantomime. I'm so excited. It's Cinderella this year, and it's supposed to be hilarious. So, um, if I can grab a few clips, then I definitely will. But.
It was so funny. Grandma, tell them what happened to you. I got soaked with water. And what did you get thrown at you? Oh, yeah. Well, the liquor, well, the liquor. Liquors, yeah. yeah. Obviously, they were clean, but... Because well, it's part of the 12... Long <laughs> it's all, the, grandma threw them down the other end of the row. And then one of the people we, one of the lovely people we were with chucked them on stage. But it was really funny because I was thinking, it had to be grandma that had the stuff thrown at her, wasn't it? And then we were ducking. And then the main guy was aiming it at me because I was hiding myself. Prince Charming, not gonna lie, he was really good looking. <laughs> Might have bought the programme just to find out who he is, Loki being a stalker. But oh no, they were really, it was just so amazing, it was so funny. The innuendos they had, it's amazing how they pull it off as a child friendly show. So? I know. <laughs> so would you go again, Grandma? Oh yeah, I think so. It's amazing, it was just so lovely, and we had ice cream, and it was just so it fun. It's really put me in the festive spirit. Not very well, Rich, is it? No, I know. Yeah, we've got it. So now, next stop, Christmas. Tomorrow, I'm doing literally coursework, really sorting stuff out, and babysitting. So. Oh no, they were chucking stuff left from the right and centre. So we're looking at the chocolates. There you go. Thank you. I got these from work. Um, I won't open it. There. Preline? Yeah. That's what Pray I thought. Yeah. Grandma just said Preline. You can tell she spent the night at the Panto. Oh, yeah. What are the other ones then? The other ones. Me and Grandma are enjoying that these. One, these are mine and Grandma's, that folks. One, the dark chocolate pear and uh, almond oh, cream. It's um, raspberry roulade. Oh, yeah, lovely. Have one of them. I um, see if when we go, I might pop into my. Sorry. I love how we talk about mini eggs at Christmas. Really? Mini eggs on Christmas Eve. Oh crikey, that's, that's right. Let me know in the comments below that's if you. That's right. Religion, right. Religion, I want. Isn't it? I want my viewers to tell me whether. If, let me know in the comments below if you think Die Hard is a Christmas movie. I don't think it's a Christmas movie. A Christmas movie. The language in it does not make it a Christmas movie. Like. I mean, fair enough, the language, there's no bad language, obviously. No. But the innuendos, but mind you, they were little children, so that... It, it literally went them. right over their heads, bless them. But they got, they did the really long list of birthdays, Mum. Oh, and basically, yeah. it was so long, he went, and then there was someone saying, it's their 21st birthday soon, and he went, well, everyone's birthday's bloody soon, you don't have to say it. Like, what's the point in writing it? Oh, it was so funny. Oh, it was... An elderly gentleman then. So we have been chilling, Mum and Lynn have, as I mentioned, die hard on. It was really, really good, but there were so many moments I was like, oh my god, what's gonna happen? But it is like half eleven. I don't have to worry about editing tonight if I don't want to, because the Wi Fi is really quick here, which is such a good feeling, not gonna lie. But tomorrow I'm gonna be doing coursework from first thing in the morning. But I'm gonna edit before then. I might edit well a video tonight, like a main video, I'm not sure yet. Um, but I'm uploading my fragrance direct haul. I'm ready to go up tomorrow at not tomorrow, Monday even. Um, so whenever that's going up, I'm a bit delusional right now, I'm so tired. But the panto was amazing, everything was amazing. It was really funny. It's great. I've got so many pictures. I'll insert a few. Making our spirits bright. What fun it is to ride and sing a sleigh and song tonight. We've already seen like quite a few clips. Um, so yeah, because by the end, near like the last final like little scene, they say like you can get your cameras out and take videos and whatever, which is really great. So 
yeah, but I'm gonna show you what bed I'm sleeping on and my sleeping arrangements because it's not gonna lie. It's not gonna feel like my bed, but it will be better than nothing. Right. Mum, Grandma's calling you. So I just got my makeup remover. Literally, this is such a squash and a squeeze, but we love it so. I don't really do all bits in my suitcase when I packed it, so I might do one of those in tomorrow's vlog. So there might be loads of content for tomorrow's vlog, but I'm gonna hopefully try and get it up the day you're watching this one at like 7 pm because I'm not going to be doing much in the evening except babysitting, which obviously I can't vlog, so. Okay. In here, I need my second charger. So I just charge my iPad. I'll just get that out. Thank you. Fluffy socks. Oh, my Saffron Barker hoodie, which I love. So that's good. My Fragrance Direct haul is uploaded as well. So it's all been good. You can just hear the faff and chats. Oh, so, yeah. Oh, literally. I'm going to go take my makeup off, which I wasn't going to do, but we've got fresh bedding and it's actually Lynn's. So, you know, it's her thin sheets that are from her airway cover, so I don't really want them covered in gold glitter. I don't think she'd appreciate it either. Or Malik has just DM'd me. Bear in mind, it's 10 to, 10 to 12, but you know, this is how our friendship runs. Mum and Grandma are arguing. Are you two arguing? What are you just saying? Night! Have a good night's sleep. Thank you.